All right, in this video, we're going to discuss the concept of data validation. Now, what exactly is data validation? Data validation helps you to dictate or control what you or your collaborators enter into this, your spreadsheet. Now, in this case, we're going to create a data validation under the column type. So what we are going to do is we are going to validate that the data will only say friends, school, or club. In other words, we want to control that these would be the only three types. So how do we access data validation? First, highlight the cells that you would like to be validated. So I've got column B highlighted. At that point, I can go into the data setting up top and click on validation. And at that point, this data validation screen comes up. Now the second way to access it is to right click your mouse and click then on the bottom most uh, term and that's the data validation. So if you click on that, the same exact data validation box appears. So two ways to access it. All right, so once we get to the screen, what do we do? You'll notice that the cell range has already been highlighted because you have already selected um, that particular range. And at that point, our criteria, if you click next to the criteria, we want to select items from a list because there are three items from which you can choose from. Now, I did not designate the choices in um, cells, so I'm not going to create a list from a range, but rather I'm going to enter the list items. And so the three that we have specified are school, club, and friends. So at this point, I've listed my three items. Um, these allow you what they say is, if someone enters something other than school, club, or friends, it is okay, we're gonna allow it to be invalid, but do show a warning. And this option here says that this list of items will appear in a drop-down menu. So we'll see how that works. Click Save. And at that point, you'll notice that the data to the right has this little button from which you can click. And when you click on that, these are the three items that show up. So great way to control the data, to validate what you want the data to be. Now, it comes especially handy when you're working with people and if they're accessing the spreadsheet and you want them to ensure that they're going to put in something that's correct, you can create this data validation so that only three options appear or options that you specify appear. Great. Thank you for listening today. www.spreadsheetsolving.com is where you can find more info, videos, and tutorials. Take care.